Right, check it. Here we are, beautiful Hilton Field. We got people in the air. We got Chili. We got all these guys. We got this guy cranking up that big airplane. We got Kenny going up in his T28. These guys are running those little okay. flex innovations, whatever those things are. You can't even see them. Those look like fun, Kenny. What, Piranha? Yeah. That way you roll, oh, you just lay down on the grass. It's all over the front of you. <laughs> all right. What the hell are they all doing out there? He's surveying where, where uh, we're going to move the runway to. Now, now, dude, honestly, I think I was here two weeks ago. I don't remember that looking as complete as it does. Yeah, no, it was there. Well, they put just, the siding on it now, but yeah, yeah, that's what it is. I think they got rid of the blue tarp, so it just makes it look. Now, if we're gonna move the runways, they're gonna he's gonna move it over there. We're gonna get away from these fucking houses. Can't move. He can't move it over there. This is uh, sister-in-law's property. This is his sister-in-law's property too. Or, it, it, aunt, or, cu or cousin, or whatever. Aunt, yeah. yeah. But th this is her property too. That's part of the problem. Kenny is up in the T-28. We're going to enjoy the uh, the flying stylings of Kenny Paniff for the next 32 minutes. <laughs> All right, taking off. He said that with, uh, with certainty. How's that T28 flying, Kenny? Nice. What do you mean it's made on this one? I've seen you fly this one before. How many of those do you have? You got two yellow ones? Yeah. Does this one fly any different, Kenny? Uh, this one's got the AS3X in it. The other one did not. The other one does not. AX3X, of course, is a gyro. Uh... What, what days are the Zooms? On Fridays? Tuesdays and Fridays. Okay. Yeah, I got your, I got your text message yesterday. I was, I was with my kids, so I couldn't, couldn't go on. But. FMS T28. No. Who makes this? E-Flight. E-Flight. I always get E-Flight and FMS confused. 
the E-Flight T28 available through Horizon Hobbies. Right. That, is that who sells the E-Flight stuff, Horizon Hobbies? Available through Horizon Hobbies. It is $269.99. Six hundred and fifty dollars. Kenny's got two of them. I actually have three of them. Well, that's right. You got the one. Now, was this purchased on uh, Scratch and Dent or something, Kenny, or no? Well, this one I got on that RC for you seventy-seven on uh, eBay, and it was yeah, it was damaged pretty good. Because I did, I did notice a little bit of touch up on the wing. Yeah, yeah, the wing was messed up pretty bad. This could be the one that you weathered. Do you, do, you have a, do you have an airbrush, Kenny? Yeah. Oh, never mind. This one doesn't. This one has the black, the black stripe there. Because you know these things are notorious for the, uh, for the exhaust going over the wing. Right. It's already there. Yeah. This one that they did the, the black stripe. I'm uh, to hide thinking that. about changing this one to the China Lake paint scheme. I don't know what the China Lake paint scheme is. It's I think that would make sense. That way you have three different schemes. Oh, and don't you don't you have that Balsa T28 too? Yeah, that's another big one. Yeah. So I have two red and white. Ones. You have two red and white ones? Well, uh, yeah, the, the Balsa. The Balsa one. ones, red and white. Okay, but it's not the same here. I saw um, somebody on, and I'm assuming it's for the E Flight one. On um, on Facebook, somebody printed up a full cockpit for the T28, and it looks pretty awesome. Couldn't even hear your lady talking. To no, you. I know. So I was just looking at my timer because I couldn't hear. You know. Looks like he's setting up to land, Ken. Yep. Hey, right foot. Yourself Those big gassers assault your eardrums. That took you back. That took you back to uh, to the old days, Kenny. Yep. When, you, when you had a one stick transmitter, and all you heard was the sound of nitro. Yeah, not not really excited about going back to it. I got a couple of nitro planes, but I don't know if I'm gonna. Oh, I thought you meant the one stick transmitter. Oh, I'd love to go back to that if I could get one. Uh, don't you have one? Don't you have well, your original have transmitter? One, but it, it's an old one. It's not. It's not a computer radio. I can't put uh, more than one airplane on it. Yeah, that's it. One airplane, one radio. Two airplanes, two radios. Right. Yeah, those days are over. You landing? Yeah. Okay. Nine. Eight. Woo. Woo. How's that thing fly, Kenny? Beautiful. I want to get one. You should get one. I want to get one. 
And what was wrong with this one when you got it? I saw a little bit of touch up on the wing somewhere. Over here, yeah. So this was rolled um, all the way over like a big U right through here. And that one was rolled under this way and it actually split right there. I had to glue that back together. So I no, steamed all terrible. that damage out, glued that back together. And uh, I haven't I haven't painted it yet because I haven't decided if I'm gonna stay with this or go to the China Lake or something else. So. China Lake. So, but that, that was most of the damage. And then there's some more damage on the bottom of the wing that I... Uh, you can't see the bottom anyway. Let's see. Oh yeah, yeah. And, it, and it, it didn't come all the way back. You can see I, there's a gap there. It shouldn't be there. It's all right. I couldn't. I couldn't steam it. It wouldn't steam all the way back out. You can't. You can't see that anymore. No. No. It's fine. It won't. It's just cosmetic. It won't hurt the way it flies. I, I really like this, and I like. I. I never care for the. Again, you know, that's why E flight kills me sometimes. That that big beautiful T twenty eight, and it's freaking bare foam. Like the yellow is nice. Your your orange. Remember the white is bare foam. And it's not a weight thing. It doesn't weigh anymore. It's a lazy thing. All right, we're out, snitches.